I power the steamboats with cut-up birthday candles. Cut because they have to fit under the engine. That's a simple candle holder, and you make it out of aluminum foil. Start by cutting up a birthday candle into four parts. You can use a razor blade, or scissors. But only one out of four candles seems to have a wick that you can light. Just nip off the wax at one end. You can use a thumbnail, or if you're careful to cut through the wax but not the wick, a pair of scissors. You need about a two inch strip of aluminum foil to make the candle holder. It can be a little tricky to tear such a thin strip. You might want to just take the roll out of the box. Two inches is about five centimeters. One strip is enough for two candle holders, and it's good to have an extra one on hand. Cut a strip in half, then fold the strip in half, lengthwise. Place a candle near the end, but not on the end. Pinch and roll the aluminum around the candle and make sort of a cup. Notice that the cup around the candle is pretty high. When the candle burns down to the aluminum, the aluminum extinguishes the candle. And notice that there's quite a bit of unburned wax wasted. So use your fingernails to squish the aluminum cup shorter. The cup is only tall enough to hold the candle. If you're working in a group, get your initials on the candle holder now. Candles. Expose the wick and make a holder from aluminum foil.